Hello everybody, my name is Nathan Sifu, and welcome to Super Mario X. Let's play. Okay, so I was getting way too frustrated with a princess cliche because that ending boss is just the worst, so we're gonna try invasion. So, at least to start off with that, and then let's talk to... They wouldn't let me in, but you had to. T uh, uh, but I had to talk to you. Don't look at me like that. Something bad has happened. I, <laughs> Bowser's joining forces with uh, villains from another, f from other realities, and is invading the Mushroom Kingdom. Please go foil Bowser's friends like you always do. I think we should really just solve the whole Bowser problem permanently, and just fucking, just yeah, just end that shit permanently. Wait, what's that? Um. Was it? I always imagine uh, uh, Disney as the substitute princess who gets stuck with. Uh, oh, da sorry. Imagine Daisy as the substitute uh, princess who gets stuck with Peach's boring paperwork while she was kidnapped. <laughs> yeah, that's probably somewhat accurate. <laughs> Super easy road. Okay, hey, you know what? After what I was just faced with, I like the sound of that. But then. Ba -da 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 -da. Okay, what you get to say. Uh, did you know that you can change your character uh, at the world map screen? No, I did not know that. All you have to do is pause the game and uh, press left or right. Really? That's cool. That's a super useful tip. Oh, I lo uh, maybe I'll try that. Maybe I'll try that out. Okay, so I really like the Mario 3 kind of vibe that we got going on. That's nice. Ah, piss. I should have seen that coming. Oh, what's this? Aren't you that plumber that everyone keeps uh, talking about? No, you, it, no, I'm actually not. Here, you can have, have what's in this chest. Yeah, I got all the coins. Sweet. Actually. Okay. Uh, yeah, I think after I'm done streaming tonight, uh, I might uh, check out if there's more level packs. Because I, I think that's what... I think that's what this game basically is. It's like... It's like you, you can get a bunch of... Aw, oh, shit. You can get these various uh, level packs, and then it's like a mini Mario game. I think that's how the structure of this works. I could be wrong. Either way, I really like it. Yes, now I've got full health. Okay. So I can take one hit. I can take one hit, and then I can take another hit after that. That's cool. Oh, no way! Oh, look at that! So this one ends... Okay, so Princess Cliché is kind of like the Mario 64 side where you're trying to get the... Um, you're trying to get all the uh, the stars. And then this one is more Mario 3 style. And I noticed that the Mario the music is a lot more Mario 3-esque. Okay. I'm still learning how all this works. And actually, in the video that I was watching... Uh, like when I had to look up stuff, it looked more like he was, um, it actually looked more like S uh, Super Mario World, like you could keep the other, um, items, and that is Mario 64, and I think my heart just might burst with nostalgia. That's just, just fantastic. I love that. Oh my god, that's a beautiful thing. I love... <laughs> you have no idea, like, what that brings me back to. Like, the... Like, to, to put it in perspective for a, like... Mario 64 was, for me, the big transition from 2D to 3D. It was, it was the very first time that I had ever played a 3D game, and it just fucking blew us away. It was that and Shadows of the Empire. It was the year that we got in 1064. And, man... Uh, what what a friggin' adventure that was! I'll never, 
I feel like that unfortunately will never be recaptured. It, it was like lightning in a like lightning in a bottle. Like you'll, I'll never recapture that experience of. Okay, come on, Peach. There we go. I'll never recapture that experience of of discovering the th uh, a 3D game for the first time. Come on. There we go. Okay. So how the heck do I get up there? Unless... Could I throw that up there? I can't do that with this one, can I? No, I can't. Shit. Alright, well, away we go. Uh, I wonder what's in that pipe above us. <laughs> Uh, maybe I could, uh, make it up there if I had a giant shoe or something to jump out of. <laughs> Super Mario 64 was, uh, the second video game I ever played. Uh, the first was Mario Kart. Really? Uh, I never truly experienced uh, the 2D to 3D shift. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, no, the, no, the 2D to, the 2D to 3D shift was, was really quite something. Like, I mean, I... Technically, before that, we had, like, Doom and Duke Nukem and that kind of stuff, but that wasn't really 3D. You were just walking around fighting, you know, paper enemies, basically. Um, yeah, you know you know what I mean? So it wasn't quite, like, really moving to the 3D stage. Um, oh, oh, excuse me. Um, and again, yes, they're technically were other 3D games before that as well, like there was, um, like there would have been games on the Sega Saturn, uh, as well as maybe perhaps the PlayStation 1, but I never had either one of those things, so, so for me that was the first 3D experience for me. And, uh, and I mean, at the time that was like the most powerful 3D game that we had, we had seen at the time, at least I think, it was something like that. Okay, so let's see. What do we got next? A lot of t a lot of pipe traveling in this game. Cool. Float a bit. Oh, I suppose you should have read the level. Oh, listen to that shit. Oh, fuck yeah with this music, man. Oh, I'm loving it. Ha <laughs> Yeah, fuck, fuck the... Fuck the... the of uh, that other level I was playing with the fucking Bowser shit. This is... Oh, I'm getting my, my nostalgia on. Oh, this is so cool. Man, this is really making me want to play Mario 64 again. That's not good. I've got too many games on my list as it is. I can't be fucking uprooting other titles. That's, I mean, Mario 64 isn't a small game. Like, like you gotta be... Like, to go through that game quickly, like, even... Oh, shit. Even if you're not 100%ing it, like, even if you're not getting all 120 stars, you gotta get at least 70 stars just to beat the game. Like, that... That's still gonna take some time, unless you just happen to know where the easiest seven, 70 stars are. No, that, that's, that shit's gonna be hard. Up we go, up we go, up we go. There we go. Okay. I've been ordered to get uh, rid of all the block... Oh, the purple block? I'm going to be here all night. Oh, I see. Okay. So they want me to help with getting rid of the purple blocks, eh? And then he'll probably give me a key as some kind of reward. Which, how do I... Wait a minute. I thought there was like a button I could pick up to do that. What the fuck? Oh, here we go. Nice. Okay. Oh, so there's a door down here. Well, I'm curious. What is this door? Oh, it's just to get through here. Oh, I can't go back here. Okay, well, I'll just... Let's, let's see. You can throw sh uh, 
shown many different ways, uh, depending on the uh, direction you are holding the control control pad when you let go of the the run button. Okay. Yes, I. Okay. Let me go. Shit, that's not quite what I meant to do. It's like, for example, I could just throw this, throw this one up. Oh, nice, and then I can do it again. Yeah, get in there. Okay, let's get the blue block. No! <laughs> What's that? Um, I've played Super Mario DS. Um, it's like the original, but, uh, but with new levels. 30 new power stars. Really? And you can play as Luigi War and Yoshi. In addition to Mario. Oh, that's really cool, man. That's super cool. Okay, get to get to get to oh shit. Damn it. Alright, let's go in anyway. Uh, oh. Oh no, but I gotta help him with all his blue blocks. How am, I gonna, how am I gonna leave a brother hanging when he's trying to get all his blue blocks broken? You can't do that. No, gotta get... Oh, oh. Ah, shit. I fell. Let's try it again. Oh, shit. I'm just gonna have to throw it at just the right angle, aren't I? Bounced right over it. Mm. Although that sounds like it's sunk in. No, oh, only a little bit. Oh, I might have to pack it up early tonight. I am feeling a little bit tired, but it would be nice if I could finish at least this level first. Oh, come on. Damn it. Get in the thing! Oh, fuck. How am I ever gonna get the thing? Maybe if I go just like this? No, okay. Gotta find the exact point, I gotta nail it. Okay, so it's gotta be, what, four squares over? Oh, come on! Oh, I was so close. How? Okay, what about slightly less than four? right there. Yeah, how can I fucking do... Mm. Okay, I'm about to give up on that shit real soon. I'm gonna have to, like, what? Just just one at a time? Just, just chip? Or I could just die. You know, that's an option. Ugh. Actually, you know what? I think, um... I think I might end it off there, and then I'll save some of this for another time. Um... Now, I might actually kind of stream this game, uh, maybe a little bit of Wings of V. Um, I might do that for the next uh, next week or two because um, I just have like this huge backlog of all of stuff to, uh, that I need to edit and get through in terms of videos. And these ones are a lot easier because the, the face cam and the, the game are all captured in one thing because I'm able to use OBS. Uh, yeah, hopefully soon I'll be able to get that, that new PC for streaming and I'll be able to uh, to do that with anything that I play. But anyway, uh, this was a, this this has been a stream of uh, Super Mario Bros. X and uh, there was certainly a lot of awesome stuff in this. There's definitely also some frustrating stuff, but I guess that was the nostalgic retro gaming experience. But uh, uh, I'll see you all next time. That was fun, but I'll have to pause it there. If you enjoy my content and want to see more, do some of the stuff that the screen is telling you, and check out my other stuff. If you want to see me play live, check out the links in the description. Come talk to me, maybe even play with me. That is it for this episode, and I will see you in the next game.